High school baseball on Friday, Oak Hill hosting Wyoming East at Jerry Epperly Field. We picked this up in the top of the first inning. Caleb Jones pitching to Eric Hoosier, who hits a ground ball into right field. DJ Rose scores the first run of the game, and the Warriors would lead 3-0 going into the bottom of the first with two outs. Noah Craddock with a deep fly ball to center field. That lands for a base hit. Craddock extends the play into a double, sliding into second. Red Devils have a runner in scoring position, but the next batter, Dawson Nybert, down the third baseline. Tanner Hall's throw to Tyler Bradford is in time for out number three, inning over. To the top of the second, Jones will get Rose swinging for the strikeout, part of a 1-2-3 second inning for Caleb Jones. Bomb of the second, Seth Crozier with a runner on third. Hits a short grounder to first. Warrior infield does not make the play. Crozier is safe. Laird Price scores to make it a 3-1 ball game, but Ethan Hoosier would respond on the mound. Dakota Shreve grounds out to Hunter Hall at short to end the inning as Wyoming East goes on to win on the road. Final score, 6-2. College baseball on Friday, Concord hosting West Virginia Wesleyan. Bobcats won game one of the doubleheader, but the Mountain Lions with the leading game two. Ryan Rado trying to claw Wesleyan back in the game, but Nate Neff starts a 5-4-3 double play and gets Austin Southcott out of the jam to the home half of the inning. Concord looking to increase the lead. Chad Frazier gives one a very good ride to center. Bobby Orns makes the play, but it is deep enough for Carter Shrewsbury to tag and score. Next batter up is Evan Webb. He would drive a ball well to left field. Alex Skinner would get turned around, and that ball would fall for a base hit as Neff trots home. Paul Williams rounding third and right behind him as Webb ends up with an RBI double. And Concord would continue their success on offense as reigning Mountain East Player of the Week Jordan Clark pulls one through the left side of the infield. Trevor Weersma trots in, and Concord wins the second game of the doubleheader. Final score, 18-5.